Hello, this is Kathy with gfreeandhappy.com. Happy National Chardonnay Day. Well, if you could tell on some of my updates that I'm a wine person, I do like my Chardonnay. So when I heard it was Chardonnay Day, I had to go all out. Kirsten Helly with Mesa de Vida, and Mesa de Vida means table of life. I'm a personal chef and nutrition consultant, and my mission is to bring life to the table of clients and families everywhere, and health as well. So not only life on the table, but bring life around the table with delicious meals and learning to love and appreciate food. I am a client of hers for a year now. Yeah, yeah, it's been exciting. Been. Yeah. So every week she sends her clients a menu and we go shopping because she sends the shopping list and you're a no-brainer all week because you have everything you need to cook a yummy healthy meal so uh, today uh, let's go with the the drink of the week which is Chardonnay and I have three different kinds and we actually have a fourth um, idea that we'll try so the first Chardonnay is my very favorite I am a member of the Chateau Michel. Um, it's the oldest winery in Washington. And if, uh, have you been there? Oh, we love it there. Oh my gosh. They have gosh, concerts, yeah. their winery is beautiful, and they have a few um, places that they grow grapes on the east side of Washington. Yes, well, cheers. Cheers, thanks. That's good. It's really good. Crisp. Mm -hmm. And this one is actually a, um, it's got a little bit of subtle oak and it's got apple and citrus. A lot of these wines are apple um, and citrus and pear, but this one actually has oak in it. I love it. I like that oaky taste. Very buttered. Yeah, that is buttered. My mouth is watered. I'm becoming more of a fan of whites. I never used to. It used to be something I'd put in my mouth and ugh spit it out. It was no good, but I'm starting to like them a little bit better. In summertime on boats yeah. um, and on the patio. It's mm -hmm. just so beautiful on this yeah. in a black. Yeah. And this one's the Waterbrook. It's actually another Washington wine and it's um, Walla Walla founding winery and it's, uh, let's see, a delicate blend of fresh green apples, lemon zest, and butterscotch with toasted almonds. Oh yeah, we should be swirling. <laughs> Get the nose. Ooh, that smells good. It's really good. I do taste butterscotch. Actually, I do too. That's really smooth. See, usually I've when they say that, that stuff. <laughs> I, I see, well, you're right. <laughs> that one's really good, so I recommend that one too. So let's, well, I don't butterscotch. know. Butterscotch, that's crazy. Oh my gosh. I right. am a huge fan of um, organic wines now. This is Organic Grapes, and it's Bonterra. Um, I actually follow them on Twitter. I love their website. They're full of information, organic wine, and it's actually in the Mendocino um, County. See, it's filled with green apple, pear, citrus, and a hint of French and American oak. That's probably why I like it, because I, I really like the oaky kind of um, wines. Okay. So thank you. Yeah, okay. that smells very different than the other two. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Good. It's a little bit sweeter, mm -hmm. and so I think that's oh. my favorite. I like that. Okay, that's, that's an orange. Orange. That's good. Actually, this is they make a few different ones, and I um, buy them at QFC in, in where we live. Good. That's and budget really friendly. Good. All these are budget friendly, and um, very good. For an organic wine, see when you said organic, I thought, oh, this is going to be an expensive wine because I don't see yeah. a lot of organic wine. So this really? particular one is very. I think it was ten ninety nine. Wow. Um, another take on Chardonnay wine that we can make a fun summery drink and that's another reason it's Memorial Day weekend so why not of course have a glass on a boat hopefully somewhere pretty or uh, let's make um, what is this called <laughs> we should give it a name we'll have to maybe we can have people vote for a name on it um, we went to Kathy's refrigerator and we, <laughs> we found <laughs> something fun. So I love Blaney's. Do you love Blaney's? Yes. Oh, so. I made that was one of our things. Oh, did you? Yeah. Oh, it's so good. So peach and then champagne. So we're gonna do a, 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 a on the moment. Yeah, something crisp and a little bit sweet. 
and fruity, so something that's great by the lake or on a boat. Let's try maybe this one. That was really good. Then we just have a little bit of peach puree. Some green apples in there. We'll do some wine and then and then uh, we're gonna just do a little bit of sparkling water just to give it some fizz and more crispness. A perfect summertime yeah. drink. Some wine and a little fruit juice. I don't think you can really go wrong with it. Ooh, it's very summer. Yeah. And then we have some fun little tasty treats to go with the Chardonnay. Um, and I do recommend these Chardonnays to go with all of this yumminess. So happy Chardonnay Day, everybody. Happy Chardonnay Day. Thank you. This is Kathy with G3 and Happy and Chef Kirsten with MesaDevita.com. Cheers. Cheers. One more. <laughs> Make sure you share this video with your friends and family and please like it and also comment if you have different ideas for um, a tasty treat or a different Chardonnay.